So here's a fun fanfiction story, and that is, as you can see, obviously, Doctor Doom versus the Multiverse. So this was a pretty straightforward story idea of basically Doctor Doom tra uh, traversing the multiverse. So the story is, is that during a fight between Doctor Doom and the Fantastic Four, um, what happens... Uh, what happens is that the, a machine he was using to, like, tap into energies from the multiverse uh, gets broken, and he gets seemingly... Doom gets seemingly killed during the event, but what happens is he gets thrown to another universe. So Doctor Doom now has to, has, has to find a way, as he's traversing through the multiverse, to get back to Earth-616, his home, and get back to his kingdom. So Doom starts out in the Gravity Falls universe, and here is where Doom is like, hmm... You know, I could almost rule if it wasn't so goddamn pr pedestrian. Um, but he does encounter Bill, and Bill says, Hey, I know the multiverse. Uh, if we make a deal, I can get you back if you help me. And Doom's like, I don't make deal with I don't make deals with demons. And Bill tries to even tries to possess B D Doom. But what happens is when he thinks he has a bo you know a great body inside of Doom. Doom literally forces him out of his body, and Bill is freaked out by that, by having himself... Because that never happened, of having... trying to possess someone, and someone forces him out, and Doom is like, Doom, you know, Doom is no one's puppet, for he is the puppeteer. So, that's Doom's whole thing. So, Bill gives him the, the ability to traverse the, the multiverse back to his Earth, the thing is, Bill kind of screwed him, because even though, yes, Bill, uh, Doom can now travel the multiverse, he's not exactly going to be able to know where he's going. And he's going to keep, like, it's going to be like a quantum leap thing, where he's going to keep quant he's going to keep leaping in between universes until he finds it. He finds his home. So, Doom, the next world Doom goes to is Amphibia. And this, and Doom shows up right in Newtopia, and is immediately captured because you would capture a guy who looks like a legit monster. So Doom is sentenced to prison, and Doom and he promptly escapes because it's Doctor Goddamn Doom. And what happens next is that Doom challenges King Endarius, you know, the giant Salaman, you know, Newt King that he is. He challenges, and 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 Darius is like. Are you kidding me? You're a guy in a tin can suit. Have you seen me? Have you seen my muscles? Have you... Do you, you know this is going to end badly for you. And Doom's like, hmm. I, I thought you would be a, ki a true worthy opponent as a fellow king. But it is clear you're just an idiot in a, in a tiny crown. I will make this quick. So Doom proceeds to kick the shit out of Indaria. He, king, he just kicks the shit out of... Uh, um, and Darius and beats him down in front of everybody and everyone is shocked at the sight of their king this mountain of a man of, of a newt getting beaten down by this little guy this little this little guy in a tin suit and doom's like <laughs> doom no you know doctor D i am doom and doom is so doom gets the energy to escape that world and he pops into the boiling isles and there, he he again encounters Emperor Bellos, and Doom is like, hmm, fellow sorcerer and a king. You might be better than the last one, but I doubt it. But what happens is that Doom gets stripped of his, uh, you know, Doom gets stripped of his magic. He gets stripped of his magical abilities, so he depends more on science. And even um, Emperor Bellos is like, hm, you can't stop me without your magic. And Doom says, Doom is many things. But he is not helpless. So Doom uses his science to combat Belos's magic and his coven's magic, and gets his magic. He gets his magical abilities back. Um, and beating and he beats down Belos. But here's the thing: it's not like a public humiliation. Doom makes a deal with him if he can like help him pop into another universe because he kind of needs like energy to pop into another universe. He basically says, "Look, I'll cut you a deal if you." Give me the magical energy I require to traverse into another universe. I won't tell anyone, and no one will know that you, you know, the the voice of the Titan was brought low by uh, by Doom. 
So Bellos agrees, gives him the magic energy, gives him his magic bag, and sends him on his merry way. Doom then moves on into the realm of Muni, and Doom encounters uh, many opponents, and he fo he basically kills his way through several monsters because he he actually ends up at like a monster camp, right in the middle of a monster camp, and he's like, "If I ever see that triangle again, I am going to kill him." And Doom proceeds to just fight his way through several mon fight and kill through his way through several monsters. Um, and of course, you kill that many people, uh, as ma those people who are subjects to uh, Queen Eclipsa, you're gonna get her, uh, uh, you're gonna get her attention along with stars and everyone else's. And Globgor is also there, so Eclipsa, Globgor, and a few others gather together to fight this this I, uh, this strange man from another universe. And Doom, all, uh, Doom says. How many uh, how many kings and queens must I lay low to prove that I uh, you know that I am the superior? And Doom again shows his superiority by cleaning house once more. Takes her uh, takes the energy he needs, pops into another universe, and this time he has ended up in um, in the world of Lyoko. He's ended up inside Lyoko, and he and immediately Doom is like. This ain't right. <laughs> so Doom has to fight his way out of Lyoko first off before he can get out of the universe. And then he has to essentially find a way out. First he has to get out of Lyoko, then he has to pop out of the universe. Because he tries he tries once already and he's like, wait a minute, something's not right. Shit, it's a world within a world. Fuck, I hate those. So Doom fights his way through several of Xana's monsters, and again resists Xana's control, because Doom is not a puppet, he is a puppeteer. So Doom resists Xana's control, hijacks um, the Lyoko warrior, after beating down the Lyoko warriors, he steals their, the Skit Blatnir, and escapes out of Lyoko and into their world, and then pops into, and then gets manages to use his energy to pop into another universe. The next universe on his tour is, uh... <laughs> he pops into the Sailor Moon universe. And it's not a pretty... And it's not a fun sight. Because Doom kills a monster, first off. Like, he encounters one of, um, Queen Beryl's monsters. And he's like, I have had enough of these games. And proceeds to just wipe the floor with this monster. And Sailor Moon and everyone else is like, Wow, I don't know who he is, but he seems really cool. And he goes, Allow me to introduce myself. I am Doom. And Usagi already goes, I don't know who this guy is, but a name Dr. Doom cannot be good. And he'd be like, And you would be right. <laughs> so, Doom gets the energy he needs from the magic from Sailor from the Sailor uh, Guardians and then moves on to another universe. He then ends up in I'm trying to remember what was the next universe on his list. Um, he ends up in Remnant, kicks the shit out of uh, Ruby and uh, out of Team Ruby and then gets their energy moves on until he finds his way back into his universe. It was just kind of like a thing where he'd just be like yeah, each uni each cha each chapter would be him popping into one universe and then just being like, "I'm here now, bring him on." So yeah, so Doom just conquers the multiverse essentially until he finds his way back to his Earth. So there you go. That was pretty much the uh, story. Just random Doom, uh, you know, Doctor Doom just going from one Earth to the next, kicking kicking ass along the way. So you guys tell me in the comments below, what did you guys think of this story? Like it? Hate it? And who would you want to see Doctor Doom encounter in the multiverse? Uh, just comment below, let me know, and once again, I'm Mr. Multiverse, I'll see you next time in the multiverse.